After entering the angle bracket here, I come to the 8th line. I open a div tag from the 8th line like this. Now the close tag of this tag is on the 10th line. So I go ahead of the div close tag on the 10th line and bring the div close tag to the 8th line from the backspace like this. Now next to the word div, it is given as style equals height colon 400px semicolon. I separate a part of the page with this div tag. Give enter near the div close tag in this way and go to the ninth line. Now open a div tag again like this. I change the way to change this in the div tag like this. Now next to the word div, it is given as style equals height colon 10px semicolon with colon 44% semicolon text dash align colon write semicolon. Please enter the same values what I tell you little friends. Otherwise, the places where these words will be displayed may change. In the 10th line of these two div tags, I open a tag. This tag is called anchor tag. We can add link by using this tag. Now, next to this tag, I give the codes which needs to be change the tags like this. I type as style equals color colon black semicolon font dash size colon 20px semicolon and enter. Now we are in the 11th row. From here I use the href tag or the hyperlink reference tag and add a link here. Let us code now. Type as href equals. Now let's find the hyperlink we want to link. Click the plus mark above and open a new tab. Next, type self dash tying shoes dash Wikipedia in the address bar and click the enter button. Now, enter the web page from the first link and select the link in the address bar like this and press C with control and copy it. Now come to the page where we are going to code. Open double quotation where it called href equals and paste the link we copied in the middle of the quotations with control and v. Now keep a small space and give as target equals underscore blank means that the link we have given should be opened in a new window. Put the cursor next to this quotation and give enter. Now we are in the 12th line. Between this angle bracket and the close tag, type as lace up. If the code we created is correct, when you click on the word lace up, the Wikipedia link will open in a new window. Now let's see the output. Now I click the refresh icon in the previous pane. But since the full output is not shown here, I go to the previously opened preview tab and click the refresh icon. Now see the word lace up is underlined. Also, when I move the mouse pointer there, the cursor icon changes to a hand icon. That means this is a clickable word. I am clicking this word now. Now look, the Wikipedia link will open in a new window. If the output comes like this, you little ones are successful. 